All right, guys, good night here. So the question is, should you do pay on delivery or pay before delivery? So if you do e-commerce and you sell product to people around the country or people in different locations as you, that means you need to find a way to get the product across to them. The thing is, from um, across the world, most times when I've tried to buy things online, I always pay up front. Right, let's say when I buy from Amazon, AliExpress, and all of them, I pay upfront for my product to get to Nigeria. But that's not how they do business in Nigeria. Most times, people want you to send the product before they pay you, and we call it, we call it pay on delivery in Nigeria. So the vendors want to receive the money before they send. The buyers want to receive the product before they pay. So it's a tricky situation, and you understand why it's why it's so. Because currently on the internet, there is um, an increase, there is a great level of fraud flying about. So there is the trust issue, there is a trust barrier there. So what exactly should you do? Should you do pay on delivery or pay before delivery? If you're starting off, it's going to give you an issue because you must encounter it, all right? You cannot run away from it unless you sell within your location, all right? Even within your location, there is usually that, that um, problem. So how do you solve it? So if you are just starting afresh and let's say you have your contacts or your orders or your, your customers readily around you, it's better for you to deliver it to them, all right? Or if you have a walk-in store where they can walk into and pick up, great. But these days, people don't even want to do that. People want you to bring the product to them, to their houses, all right? So. To be completely frank, that's the fastest way to sell these days, pay on delivery, because you are reversing trust issues for people. You are reversing, um, you are reversing the risk involved with doing business for them. So now, if you have your orders more from outside your location or where you are, what you have to do is, uh, let's say you have more orders coming from PH and you are in Enugu or you are in Kano or you are in Abuja, but you have you get a sizable chunk of orders from PH and you are not in PH, you don't have any physical store. What you have to do is you have to look for delivery agents. There are people who it's their job, they will help you warehouse your products and then they will ship it out from there for you. All right. So you find them and you keep your products for them. This way you can offer people who are in Port Harcourt pay on delivery, even the same day delivery at some point. All right. And they can it's easy for you to to make more sales that way all right so you look for self delivery guys we call them self delivery guys they can help you warehouse your products and then when you get an order they will just help you ship it out you can equally use some of the offices as your pickup location for people who are ready to go and pick up all right so that's how you do it if you sell within your area let's say you are in lagos or you are in enugu and you are just servicing your your immediate environment what you should do is you should try to make the deliveries yourself if you have the time this will be better for you it will help you build more trust because when you meet these persons the issue of them um, if you are legit or not dies down so in your subsequent transaction the issue of pay on delivery or pay before delivery is completely called off so these persons can conveniently send you money up front because they've met you and they, they trust you all right, I've done these things before and it's, it, it works. All right, so sometimes even till now, I still deliver some of my products myself. If they are within my, they are within places I can cover, I go and deliver them. All right, so it's more convenient that way and it's going to save you a lot of money, help you build your trust, your trust faster and make you more loyal customers. So in summary, the issue of pay on delivery or not, if you want to be really, really successful selling products online these days, you have to do pay, um, uh, pay on delivery, all right? You have to do pay on delivery. That is the sad reality of the industry. So you have to do pay on delivery. If they are not around, you have to use, um, if they are not around, you have to use self-delivery guys. If they are around you, you can try to deliver it yourself. Or use dispatch riders. These dispatch riders, they, they hold the product until the person makes you a transfer. So that's my take on that. I hope you found this video useful. If you do, you should 
give me a like or a thumbs up and i'll see you in the next video bye bye